Yo, guys, welcome back to episode 10 of the Melee Terraria series. Thanks, guys, for supporting me all this way. We're already at 10 episodes of full double digits, and that's amazing to me. So today, we got some big plans to do as well. Since last time, as you might have known, we um, went into the underground, um, just underground biomes to go get some titanium, power up, get our titanium armor. And we also got a power glove our, along the way while getting a titan glove from a mimic, which is pretty cool. So today's video, um, what we're going to do is we're going to fight the goblin army so I can get the shadow flame knife from the goblin summoner. And then we're going to go get some wings um, so, you know, we can fly better and, you know, we can take this off. You served us all fledging wings. And then we're going to go fight some queen slime after we make the arena. So it's going to be an action-packed episode today. Now, first, we're probably going to get started with the Goblin Invasion, just right after I get the Summoner for it. Alright, guys, we got the Goblin Battle Standard. Um, we're going to use it right now, so that as you can see, a Goblin Army is approaching from the east. Hopefully, I can get this first try, because um, I really don't want to farm out for this and farm out for those um, tattered cloth again. I only have one right now, and I have to farm another nine. It wouldn't take as long as, um, per se, farming out like the pirate invasion. Or maybe that would be easier. But it still takes pretty long. So we're just going to um, chill and not do anything about that right now. Our hole! Hey, it looks like it's here already. Let's get these guys out of the way so we can um, deal with her only right now. All right, all right, all right, going pretty good so far. About well, 3,000 health, which is a pretty decent amount. Now it's about to die. Let's see if we can get the uh, knife first try. Um, no, we got the hex doll, but we still have the entire fight to find, like you know, fight another one or two of them, which is good. All right, so we'll continue on with that right now. Up oh, here we are, another summoner. It's kind of ironic that um, th it's called the summoner. Yet the only what kind of weapon you don't get from it is a summon weapon. It's, it's, it's kind of weird, honestly. I mean, sure, mods do it. I mean, the Thoria mod even adds a bard weapon for this uh, mini boss, which is really interesting, honestly. Although, can you really consider it a mini boss when all it does is like some of these little flame dolls shoot these balls and fly? I still don't think it's an actual summoner slash um, mini boss. All right, all right, we're slowly whittling it down. It's almost down. To the point we want it at. Come on, give us the knife. Yes, let's go! Shadow Flame knife, boys. Anyways, if we just take this and put it um, in place of something, let's say this for now. And we can use it. Oh my god, let's go. This is so cool. Oh my god. This is going to be great for Queen Slime, I'm not going to lie. It's going to be super effective with its bounty effect. And it goes so fast because of our glove. Nice. And it also has the shadow flame effect on it, which is a very, very nice addition. Alright. Well, it looks like we don't have to farm out for this anymore. That's good. I haven't actually used this weapon seriously since 1.3 actually came out. So around the um, 2015 of uh, June, July area. Like, jeez. It's been a while. But I can see this weapon. Jeez. Even the, even the summoner who's immune to uh, Shadow Flame is getting pretty wrecked from this. And boom, another summoner down. We just got another Shadow Flame Hex doll, okay. Oh boy, it's another summoner. Okay, let's deal, we have to deal with that then. Alright, alright, alright. Going good so far. There we go. Oh, we got another Shadow Flame Knife. Let's go. I just realized, I don't think this one even has an effect on it. So it's really good, and we can reforge it. Alright, the Goblin Army has been defeated. So... We just got our cool weapon, and now we're going to go upgrade it a bit. But first, let's go put away some of the spoils of the war, a.k.a. the two Shadow Flame Hex dolls we got, and the uh, other uh, Shadow Flame knife, too. Oh, wow! Godly! Let's go! Anyways, let's just sleep for now, and then we, in the morning, we can go, um, go up to a floating island and get ourselves a, a pair of wings when we kill some wyverns. Oh, no, we have a Blood Moon. Now we have to wait. You know what? Let's actually go farm out some items for during this Blood Moon, actually. Like, we could probably get some really good stuff. Like, if there's a Clown Spawn, you can give us a KO Cannon. That's pretty good. Um, later on, after I defeat one of the mech bosses, or um, maybe before I do, I'm going to fight um, a Blood Eel so I can get the Drippler Crippler. Since um, it's a new 1.4 item, and it's melee. It's a double pog, honestly. Oh, there's a Clown. 
Oh, we can also get banana rings from this guy. Oh, they added clattering teeth. I forgot about that. That's kind of weird. Bruh. All right, what did we get? Uh, oh, um, I forgot about this. <laughs> right. <laughs> um, let's let's just let's just see how this goes. Uh, <laughs> I was not expecting this right now, but I totally forgot. I mean, we should probably try to do our best, but uh, really, how can how how best can we do during this? You know, I probably should get a cobalt shield soon. That's probably what I'll uh, replace the um the emblem with when I get to uh, be able to put some effects on. So far, okay, okay, this is going, it's going, it's going. Yeah, I'm gonna cut a lot of this out. Um, this is honestly just a train wreck. <laughs> oh my god. We did a pretty good number on the um, laser, though. If like, we got the laser out of there, we could have done a lot better. But I'm not too worried since, you know, we're not really prepared for something like that right now. So, yeah. Let's just respawn. And let's continue the Blood Moon. Honestly, this is a great weapon for crowd control and for a boss fight. Because you could just, like, like bop, 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 bop the enemies over and over. And the knives go, like, all the way over. And it's a pretty small but accurate weapon. So, it, shooting it and hitting it in target is still pretty easy. Unless it's like a really small one, but you don't really get the Cheetos too much, so that's good. Alright, here's a Wyvern. Now this Shadow Flame effect should be pretty good for whittling down when we get it on all of its segments. As so. It's taking out a little bit, but that's because it's a Wyvern and the weapon we're using. It's like the, the worm bot, like these worm things are the one thing this weapon is not really a, too effective against. Alright, 16 souls of flight. Alright, we need one more Wyvern, and then we'll be good. All right, here's the other wyvern we need. We can use this guy, and then he will definitely give us enough for a set of wings. Oh, we should probably stand next to him so our titanium armor can um do its effect onto it. That sounds that sounds good. That sounds good. good. All right, there, there we go. We can take this off, collect these, and I think we um can now see what kind of wings we can make. We require 25 of each. Oh, and we also have one of these events happening now, I guess. Okay, I got, I'm going underground. So I'm going to go farm out some souls of night so I can go get myself some demon wings. So I'll see you guys after I have enough of those. Oh, we got the chain knives. Okay. I mean, it could be part of our collection, I guess. Anyways, we're getting good with our collection so far. Or collecting the souls of night. We got uh, two right now. We need um a bit more, though. Oh, thank goodness. We can leave this biome. Oh, my God. It's getting pretty intense down there. No, I don't remember. Is it just a 25 or is there something else that I'm missing? Let's see if we can make them now. Nope, we do need, I think it's like feathers or something. Yeah, we need 10 feathers. Time to grab a grab potion. Go back up to the sky. Make sure we're ready to get 10 more and then we'll be ready. Okay, okay, Blood Moon, but we have all of the materials to make the thing. Let's go quickly make it. Okay, okay, ward off this guy. Boom, Demon Wings. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go to the under... Oh, I can't believe he followed us, actually. Okay, 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 quickly, go back. Okay, I guess not. I guess I lose all my gold. This is going to be a bit annoying to deal with. I'm not going to lie. All right, guys, we made it over to the Hollow Biome, and this is where we're going to fight some Queen Slime. But first, we have to actually set up an arena for that, so... I'm gonna go start working on that right now. And I think I'm just gonna cut it because um, I don't think this is really necessary for the video. So I'll see you guys when I'm done with this arena. All right, guys, we have arrived in the hollow. We finished our uh, arena. As you can see, it's pretty wide. Um, I've got five potions, did with five of these for the wall of flesh. I've got chicken nugget to improve all of my stats, you know, medium wise. And I think we're gonna go start this after we, um, you know, kill it. Uh, pixie. So let's just buff up. Another pixie. Summon Queen Slime. No, I, the first time I fought Queen Slime, I was not too much of a fan of it. Especially in Master Mode. I could just not figure out its AI and how to defeat it. But I get, eventually got there. And this time I think it would be pretty easy. Especially with the uh, knives we got. See, okay, okay, okay. The fight's going, it's going, the fight's going. 
progress for getting these guys down. Uh, I'm not a big fan of all the projectiles that these guys are spitting out and stuff, but you know, that's, that's expected from Team Slime now. But as far as all that, going good, going good. You know, getting these guys out. The Shadow Flame Knife is doing pretty good progress on it. Too. Okay, okay. It's been so long since I fought Queen Slime too. I can't believe there's one of the two new bosses they added. Why did they have to add two new hollowed bosses? They could have added something like, you know, I don't know, a um, a new boss to the uh, pre-hard mode. Well, that that's obviously not hollowed since hollowed is exclusively hard mode. But yeah, Jesus, this is getting really hectic right now, and I don't mean the YouTuber. Funny reference. Oh my God, I'm gonna of all these guys here. We're still doing pretty good, we're still doing pretty good. Um, I don't think this boss is like really meant to be too much of a challenge. Um, okay, maybe I could be wrong, you know, with all the freaking projectiles in the air. All right, first heal, first heal, baby. Well, you know, that's kind of expected. Okay, okay, Queen Slime slammed down. That's good, that's good for us. We can gain some um, coverage on the distance between it and us. All right, all right, all right. Just avoid all the freaking projectiles. Oh my god. It's gonna be like a queen slime projectile boss. Oh, oh, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there. And let's go, baby. Queen slime defeated. And I got the achievement. Just desserts, baby. Let's go. Ow, oh, okay, stop. Alright, let's just get these guys out of the way and we'll be done. <laughs> oh, we also got a lot of slime too, which is pretty cool. There we have it, everyone. Queen slime, first try, baby. This is such a great weapon. Oh my god. Anyways, let's just pick up our... Well, that's what we already have. Um, and let's go back home. And right now. And now we will open the Queen Slime treasure bag in 3, 2, 1. Boom. Oh, nice. We got two of the, the top two crystal assassin helmets. Nice. Uh, this one increases defense by 5%. Or damage by 5%. This one increases critical strike by 5%. There's 12 on... Okay, 14. Um, yeah, it's, it's not as good. Um, the volatile gelatin. That is what we might put right here. It's it's it's, it's like the um, it's like the bone glove from the uh, Stealthron, where we can actually shoot out items while we're by enemies. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And it even like releases it without having to attack. We also got this thing, which is really cool. So if we just put this on, boom, we can even fly for a short distance with this mount. Nice. I really like this. Wow, and it's really fast too. Jeez. Well, this was an interesting episode today, everyone. I, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Funny, funny. Anyways, guys, that does it for episode 11, I believe. Uh, if you liked the video, then consider subscribing, uh, liking the video, and sharing it with a friend. My name is Just the Joe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode, where I think we're gonna go fight um some of the mech bosses. So I'll see you then, honestly. Yup, here we go. Spasmatism is going, it's spazzing out.